Hello, I'm the Twitch Gamer, and we're going to be doing a let's play of Atelier R sorry, Atelier Rorona DX, the Alchemist of Arland. Now, I have played this game before, back on the PS3, which was, it was quite nice. I, I it, it was my first venture into the Atelier series, and I enjoyed it quite, quite a lot, so I'm quite happy to be here once again. Now, I am playing it on the Switch because, well, several reasons, in fact. Like, the Steam version, I don't trust Koei Tecmo in terms of PC ports because my experience so far has not been great. So it's sort of like, right, I'll go with a console version. And because of Sony's weird censorship thing that's going on right now, it's like, I don't want to support them. So, you know what? We'll go with the Switch version instead. Simple as that. Now, another thing about this game... Back on the PS3, it did have a sexually transmitted disease. I know, you're thinking, what? What are you on about? It had STD. Indeed, indeed. But it's fine. It's fine. In this game, we're STD free. So, right. I've already sorted the options. I'll show you what I've done with this so far. I may have to tweak them later because I'm not entirely sure what each one of these represents because it doesn't give me a way to sample it. It would be nice. It would be nice. I really do need to actually get a proper controller for the Switch now, because I'm going to be playing on Switch more than PS4 going forward, just because of the fact those censorship rules. It's like, you know... Right, so anyway, let's begin a new game with Atlia Rorona. Arland. A small kingdom built upon ancient ruins several hundred years ago. I love the music. It was a peaceful kingdom, isolated from an advanced world. Do -do -do -do. One day, ancient relics, called the machines, were discovered among the ruins. The people of Arland had no idea what to do about them at first. Resisting the urge to hum along. Then, a traveler who just happened to be visiting the kingdom at the time showed everyone how to use the machines. Over the next few years, Arland prospered dramatically thanks to the machines which enabled all citizens to live a life of leisure and luxury. To thank the Traveler, the reigning king granted the Traveler one wish. The Traveler said, Then allow me to run an alchemy workshop in this kingdom. I'd have asked for more than that. Many years have passed since then. A girl and her alchemy master now reside within that workshop. <laughs> the girl's name is Rorolina Frixel. But everyone in town just calls her Rorona. It's easier to say. Ah, the music! I'm back. And so am I. And of course, Master's not here. I wonder where she goes every day. Maybe one day we'll find out. Oh well. I like it better when she's not around. Otherwise, she would be picking on me every minute of the day. I'm sure we won't have any customers today either. So, I can manage things here by myself. Oh, did she come back? Wait, why would she bother to knock? It's a good point. Excuse me. I will. You may leave. You can definitely tell graphics-wise that this is 
come from a PS3 game, let's put it like that. Um, who are... Uh, are you a customer? Oh no, well, what do I do now? Um, uh, uh, sorry, uh, no one from this workshop is here right now. I mean, well, uh, I'm, I'm from this workshop too, but... M um, master? Uh, I mean, the owner isn't here. You're doing a great job here, Arona. Dear, oh dear. Oh, excuse me. Uh, d d d do you want a refreshing beverage or, or anything? I could go for a cup of tea. Oh, I should offer you a seat, right? Uh, uh, come on in. Oh, you're already inside. Something tells me the background music needs to go down a notch. Not too much, just a little bit. It may help if you just calm down for a second. Oh, so sorry. Calm down, Rorona. You can do this. Just take a deep breath. <sighs> do you feel better now? I sure hope she does. Otherwise, this is going to be a mess of a conversation. Uh, y yes, thank you. Excellent. Now, first of all, I'm not a customer. I'm a royal messenger. Oh, no. A messenger? That's right. Now, if I understand you correctly, Astrid, the owner, isn't here right now. No, uh, and I don't know where she went or when she'll be back. I see. Then, do you mind taking a message for me? I do mind. Now, would you leave? Oh, no, I don't mind. Paper and pen, paper and pen. Oh, okay, I'm ready. By orders of the minister and king, this workshop is to be closed down. Oh, wait, wait what? Okay, this workshop will be... What? The details will be explained to her in private. Please have her come to the castle as soon as she returns. If she ever returns. Well, wait! Well, it's it's to give you incentive in order to work hard and make sure that the workshop doesn't close. I mean, it's it's basic setup to a story, really. Oh wait, you're not you. Yeah, four 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 four. Ah, what should I do? Is it all my fault? Did I do something wrong? Why did this have to happen while Master's gone? Ah, I need you, Master. You give me no choice but to come out now. It's it's strange. Because obviously back when in, it, I, I was like playing these type of games on the PS3, I didn't really pay attention to the voice actors, but it's like hearing them now, it's like I recognize them. It's very strange. Well, there we go. Astrid Zixis. I remember her looking a bit more stern, is the best way to put it. I've been here the whole time. I was taking a nap in the next room. Ah, there we go. That's the Astrid I remember. Like I said, just, just a tad bit more stern. Plus, don't call me Master. I told you to call me Big Sister. At least it's not Big Bro. Oh. But that's kind of embarrassing. And, well, that's not the point right now. A royal messenger stopped by and... You don't have to tell me. I heard everything. Oh. Then why didn't you come out here? I'm sorry, but I just couldn't help myself. I just love to see my dearest pupil panicking. Anyway, they're finally on our tail about this workshop. Hmm. Let me ask the question. Why did they want to close it down to begin with? Please, hurry and go to the castle. Yeah, we need the details. I'm not in the mood today. Will you go there for me? What? Well, but I can't. They asked for you. Well, I'm not going. I need to catch my beauty sleep. I'm counting on you. What? Master, wait! You can't... That's not how this works. This is your alchemy shop. Do I really have to go? Oh... 
That's nice to see a globe actually turning. It's very rare in games you'd find. You can save or load your data by accessing the journal on the desk. You can also access the dressing room and change the BGM from the diary. You can now use the shortcut function while in town. Pressing the R button, I suppose, the shoulder button, uh, will bring up your options and selecting one will take you there instantly. Can you use that already? That feels strange. Okay, so I want to... Where's the actual menu? Is it going to be that button? Ooh. Oh, so that does it as well. So that goes there. I'm just trying to find... Yeah, that's what I'm trying to find. Oh, look! It's Kirby! It's Kirby! Ah, oh, lovely! Anyway, um, what am I trying to find? Oh, I forgot I could do that. Oh. I want the menu. I want the menu. The settings. Is it not, is it maybe in the manual? There, too. there we go. Is that somewhere, please, that tells me how to get back to the menu so I can change the volume levels. That's what I'm after here. Is, is a hum. I like the hums in the later games. Let's put it like that. These characters we will be seeing later. Oh, there, there's, there's what I was going on about. Like, SD there. Like, her name used to be very different. I think you can figure out what her last name was. SD. D. SD. D. Yes. Yes. Right, 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 right. Check manual display log. Is there nothing? Where is it? Like, it says system menu is the R button, but. It says the system menu is the R button. But it's not. So, how does that work? Maybe it's just over here. Oh, there, there we go. It said system menu. It said it. It said it. Anyway, let's do that. Uh, we'll go with that. We'll go with that for now. Okay, so let's actually look at the... Um, can we change this? Maybe get something from a later one or something. Pamela Shop. Recognize that name. Is there anything? I'm just trying to think, like, is it, is it going to add any from the later at layers? Doesn't seem like it is, though. It's got to Tori, so. Let's actually get our own back, though. There we go. Right, so, what will we do? Oh, yeah, dressing room. Dressing room. See what we can get. A new costume has been added. How does it look? I mean, eh. all done. Nah, look? it doesn't really suit you. I wonder if this is a good fit. Is it just gonna be all all swimsuit? Can we not have anything that's like like an alchemist outfit? I, I, I want something else. Fit. How does it look? Nah, all done. I suppose that's How do I look? the closest, but oh, I'll just How does go it with look? that. Go with that, right? So hair accessory. All done. No. How do I, all done. No. How does it look? Funny it is. <laughs> how's the? <laughs> how's the, all done? How Again, do I, I like done? her hat. I like do her I hat. Look? How does it look? Wait, we don't have any facial accessories. Okay. So now we we'll just stick with what she's got normally. She was like, oh, I would have liked another costume that would have been more f fancy. Fancy is the best way of putting it, isn't it? Right. So let's actually. Um, what day is it? Yes, let's go outside. Because this is the thing, we're definitely on a schedule this time. I've noticed it, but I can't interact with it. So which way do I want to go? That's the question. I want to, I want one. Here they are, here we are, here we are. You're not saying it? But you, you definitely said it in the PS3 version. Barrel? Barrel! Why does she no say barrel? Did they take out the voice clip for barrel? Why? I'll get in the shop. All right then. Do I do I really have to go? All right then. So let's head to the palace front desk. Why do I have to do this? I mean, she always makes me do everything. <sighs> Am I here already? I think this is the first time I've ever been to the castle. 
I'm getting nervous. That messenger guy was scary. Who was scary? It says TD. Oh, yes. They changed her name. Ah! You scared me. <laughs> Sorry about that. Can I help you? You don't look like one of my clients. I, I, I'm actually from the workshop. Uh, this guy. Oh no, I forgot to get his name. Um, well? The workshop? Oh, I know what's going on now. Come with me, I'll show you the way. Now music still feels it's just, again, just a tad too much. Uh, okay. Thank you. Ooh, lovely. There he is. Whoa. I didn't know this is what the castle looked like on the inside. I'd better not look around too much. There he is. That's the guy you're looking for, right? Yes, I recognize that cloak anywhere. Y yeah, yeah, that's him. Stirk, you've got a visitor. Huh? What kind of name is Stirk? I think you scared her, Stirk. I did? Yeah, I mean, with that ominous robe you seem to be wearing or cloak with that scary look on your face you have to be nice to girls you know well have fun um hello you didn't get her name i wanted her to say her name all right mm, triple dot he looks mad what are you doing here I thought I asked for Astrid. Oh, yeah. Well, she said she wasn't in the mood. <laughs> so... Some people never change. Um, do you know her? She's just an old acquaintance. I guess I should introduce myself to you then. My name is Sturkenberg. I'm a knight of this castle. Oh, that's, that's a more proudful name, isn't it? Oh, there we go. Sturkenberg. Kranach? Kranach? Stirkenberg. Stirk. Stir. Hold the door. Hold the door. Hold the. I know it's a bit long. You can call me. Sturkey! Can I call you Sturkey? Oh dear, oh dear. Please call me Stirk. Sturkey! Because he doesn't like it, so there we go. Aww. Sturkey is much cuter. Oh, and my name is Rorona. Pleased to meet you. Likewise. Anyway, about the workshop. Do you have to close it down? We just started the game. That's right! Why are you closing down our workshop? Is it because Master's never there, and even when she is, she sleeps all day and never works? That might be why. Or is it because nobody in town likes her? Or... That might also be why. Those are terrible things to say. But all true. Though, I guess I should have explained it better. The closing of the workshop isn't official. Yet. Yet? We will give you assignments to complete and make our final decision accordingly. Assignments? The kingdom will assign a job to the workshop, such as... The assignments! Report to Stirk once you have the items. An assignment from the kingdom will be given to you every three months for three years. That's a total of 12 times. D did I skip one? I don't know. Every assignment will consist of making something with alchemy and turning it, and turning it into Sturk. We have to turn an item into Sturk? But then we'll have loads of items that look like Sturk. Very strange. Try to complete an assignment by the deadline. Assignments have deadlines, so make sure you turn them in before it's too late. That's the whole point of a deadline. View the status of an assignment from Verona's status menu. Your evaluation can be viewed from the menu. Alright then, so is that him saying it or, or what? You can report as many times as you want until the due date. Turn in as many items as you can before the deadline to get the best evaluation. Optional quests. Alright then, missing the quota and the Atlia 
might close. Strange sentence. It should say, miss the quota, and the Atlia might close. But all right, uh, good things happen when quests are completed. There are other optional quests in those required to keep the Atlia running. Ugh, it's a pain to say Atlia. Fulfilling these requests will award various, various bonuses. There we go. No set deadlines, but they are updated every three months with, with the kingdom requests. So complete them before then. We've got a bingo card. Uh, make a line by collecting the stamps. Turning in and completed request to Sturk will award vouchers and a stamp. I don't remember this. So I'm assuming this is something that was added in the plus version. I don't know. When you fill a line on your stamp card, you will receive a bonus. The center of the card will receive a stamp when you've completed the required request for the term. Exchange items for tickets. Vouchers can be exchanged at the palace front desk for various items. And that's about it. I'll let you know when your first assignment is ready. Okay. So, what if we fail an assignment over the next three years? We burn the Atlia to the ground. Then we will close down the workshop immediately. That's a good way of putting it. Oh. Senior Esty, the lady that you met earlier, can help you with interacting with the townspeople. STD! Anyway, I know that was a lot of information to take in all at once, but please make sure to tell Astrid. Yes, of course. I better go back before I forget. Excuse me. Thank you. She's nothing like Astrid. Which is a good thing, I guess. It depends. She could be the complete opposite, which could be just as bad. Alright then, so help page quest request from the kingdom edit. Quest optional request added. Yeah, 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 all this type of stuff. But yeah, I'm very disappointed, like, where, where is Esty? Esty's just disappeared. All right, then. Yeah, I'm very disappointed by that. It's like, I, I really expected to have, like, loads of jokes I could do about STD. But they changed her last name. I I can see why, but, you know, STD. Who are you? Simon, this is the Palace of Arland. Watch what you do here. Or not. This place isn't really all that formal. Fair enough. I'm really disappointed. Where's my barrel? Where's my barrel? I wanted barrel. Hmm. Just feels wrong. Feels like I've been cheated. I severely doubt it. <sighs> like that's gonna happen. <sighs> What's wrong with you? <clears throat> oh, this feels very strange. It's Cordelia Corey, for short. Now this character, I I really like this character. And I, I never remember, remember, yep, remember hearing Blonde's voice come from Corey, so this is very, very strange to me. Ah, Corey, don't tackle me like that. What? I was just trying to cheer you up since you look sad. You should be thanking me instead. Oh, you were trying to cheer me up? <laughs> Thanks, I do feel better now. Simple-minded, or just plain dumb? Hmm, it's a good question. Huh? What did you say? Nothing. So, what's the matter? Did that lady do something to you again? No. Well, sort of. Well, this guy from the castle came to the workshop today and... You didn't get a fade out and a fade in. It feels strange. Well, I knew something like that was going to happen. You guys haven't had any customers for days. I know, but... 
cares? If the workshop closes, it won't affect anyone one bit. Well, that's a bit harsh. It'll affect Rhoda, I suppose. What about me? Corey, you're so mean. Do you remember the reason why you started working there to begin with? I needed the money? Of course. My parents got sick when I was little and Master gave us the medicine to heal them. Yeah, and? But we didn't have any money to pay for it. So I decided to help her out at the workshop. There we go. Okay, so what'll happen if the workshop is closed down? I'm finally free. Well, I wouldn't be able to work at the workshop. So I'd have to go home. Oh. Oh. See? No one's gonna care if the workshop is gone along with that lady. That's kind of sad. Why? Does she even know about this? No. I was about to go tell her. Hmm. Then I'll come with you. I can't wait to see the look on her face when she finds out about this. <laughs> it's very, very blonde-esque though, isn't she? Corey, can't we all just get along? No way! Come on, let's go! I do like that. It's like, can't we all just get along? No. Why is she brushing herself off? I'm back. Master? I didn't think you'd still be here. You make it sound like I'm never here. Oh, and you're with the heiress of the Feuerbach family. The what? Don't call me that! Fine, I'll call you Cory then. You know, to be friendly. Uh-huh. No! Wh what I don't like this, I don't like that. Boy, you're so demanding. <laughs> I'm not demanding! Oh, p p please don't fight! Anyway, I went to the castle. I know, I've been waiting for you to come back. We just went off on a tangent because of Cory. I didn't do anything! There's another fade out, fade in. I see. I knew they weren't going to close down this workshop right away. Can't you at least be a little freaked out? This isn't any fun to watch. Why don't you run around with your hands in the air crying, Oh no, my workshop! Or, I'm being exiled! Panicking won't solve anything. Besides, you seem awfully calm. Why shouldn't I be? <sighs> Rorona, and you call yourself her friend? You're gonna have to leave the kingdom too if the workshop is closed. What? Why? What? Me too? What are you talking about? Don't drag her down with you! But Rorona owes me a ton of money. I can't let her go until she pays it all back. God damn it, that was our out. Or did you think I was going to be nice enough to forget all about that? But you're Astrid, you're so super nice. <laughs> <sighs> you're right. I forgot your scum rotten through and through. I'll take that as a compliment. Really? All right. Either way, this is a good lesson for you. You can't just lie around all day like you used to. Everything will be all right, as long as you take this seriously. Ah. Uh. Of course. I'm sure I can do anything if I put my mind to it. Oh, I am so glad to hear that. <laughs> anyway, what are you making? Oh, this? It's just a new sign for the workshop. I thought it might drum up some business for us. So, you are putting some thought into this. Oh no, no, this is something I've been working on for the past three years. It's ready. Let's go put it up. Oh, it's lovely. What do you think? Not bad, huh? Indeed, it's a good CG. And the sign's good as well, I suppose. Aw, it's so cute! Atelia Rorona. We're changing the name of the workshop, too? Shouldn't you be more concerned it has your name on it? Wait, what? This workshop is yours from now on. I'm counting on you. You are so lazy. No, no, I can't do this. It's impossible. I'm gonna sell it. Pay you back, and then, you know, I'll be fine. I can leave. 
What are you thinking? She's too nice, clumsy, dumb, and sheltered to own a workshop. You didn't have to say all that. But it's true. I don't know anything about alchemy. You never taught me anything. What that? That's kind of bad. Don't worry about that. Here, take this. What is it? It's some kind of strange, weird thing I've never seen before. It's called a beaker. Oh, there we go. Received beginning alchemy. A book? Yes. It's got all of the basics of alchemy written inside. My master gave this to me when I started training. It must mean a lot to you. Are you sure you want me to have it? Of course. You're my number one pupil. She's your only pupil. Master, thank you very much. I'll do my best. No, Verona, stop. She's just tricking you. Oh, I'm so tired from making the sign. I better go take a nap. Oh, dear. Hey, wait! Verona, stop reading that book! It's too late now. She's gone. What? Oh, Master, please, wait for me! Day nine. Oh, we're gonna drop the voice acting, all right. Is it morning already? Why am I sleeping on the floor? Oh yeah, I was reading the book and then I fell asleep. <gasps> oh, where's Master? What's the thing that's on the table? Some kind of loop of some sort. Master? M Master! She's gone. So this really is happening. I can't do this. But if I don't, the workshop will be... Huh? What's this? A letter from Master? Don't worry. You can do this. I believe in you. Plus, I'm really lazy. Triple dot. That's right. Master believes in me. I can do this. Master, I will do my best to carry on your legacy of sleeping in until about mm, three in the afternoon. She's not even gone anywhere. She's making it sound like I'm dead or something. Her simple minded mindedness is really impressive. Anyway, I wonder how long she'll last. Still no voice acting, alright. So what should I start with? Hmm. How to synthesize. I mean, I generally know it all, but we should go through it, shouldn't we? Do, 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 do. I should just follow the instructions in this alchemy book, right? I should test it out. Hmm. What can I make first? Do, 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 do. Synthesis. Access the cauldron at the workshop to synthesize. You can synthesize by accessing the cauldron or by selecting Synthesis from the main menu. Synthesis is a system in which you combine various items to create an entirely different item. Gather the ingredients, yep, yep, yep. To use Synthesis, you need a recipe and the ingredients to make the item. The recipes and ingredients can be purchased at shops, gathered from the field, or given to you by someone. Let's try making a supplement from the recipe that you got from Astrid. Do that. Ba, 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 ba. Yeah. It's basically the same as the other ones. Done! It's bad. It's bad, though. Supplement complete. Synthesized items can be used for ingredients during battles or in many other ways. Try synthesizing as many things as possible whenever you get a new recipe book. 
Please view the library in the main menu for more details on Synthesis. Do, 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 do. Synthesis will consume both days and energy. To restore energy, use a healing item or utilize the couch in the workshop. When you access the couch, you can select the number of days to recover. Definitely have to be very mindful. Just making sure I wasn't going to talk over anyone. Then. Mindful of the days in this one. It's very important. I did it. It really worked. I might actually be good at this. I'm starting to see the light at the end of the tunnel. Yeah, you speak too soon. All right, what should you do next? Um, ingredients for synthesis. Bum, 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 bum. I need ingredients to synthesize, but there aren't that many left at the workshop. I'm sure I could buy them from the shops, but I don't have any money. Guess I'll have to gather them myself. But I heard that there are a bunch of monsters outside of town. Oh well, I should just go check it out. I'll just come back if it's too dangerous. Do, 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 do. Oh, are we off? Verona, what are you doing here? Cory, um, I was gonna gather some ingredients to synthesize stuff. What? You mean outside of town? Mm-hmm. Are you really that stupid? You know that there are monsters out there, right? Someone as weak and clumsy as you would get killed instantly. Hmm, I know how to protect myself. No, you don't. You don't even know how to protect yourself from a little child. Mm, but I can't synthesize without the ingredients. And if I can't synthesize, the workshop will... Uh, fine, I'll come with you. Are you sure? Don't turn me down, just go with the flow. No, I, I mean... I don't know if going with you will make any difference. It's so much better than going alone. Cordelia has joined the party. Oh, lovely. Hiring! Well, it's... Yeah, yeah, we can talk to our friends. Verona is able to hire up to two people to join the party. Cordelia is the only person available so far, but more people will be able to join as you meet more people. Once you hire a party member, he, she, will come to the gathering points with you and will help you fight monsters. Hiring a party member means that you have to pay a fee each time. You can't hire any more anymore anyone if you don't have enough money to hire a person talk to him her then select invite hmm. okay dismiss you to remove a party member go to status menu for, yep and then select remove please view the library in the main menu for more details on party members i don't want to go there yet just i don't i don't want to go there yet Alright then, fine. Right, so I'm looking at the time here, and I think this might be a nice place to end this part. So in the next part, we'll head off to the nearby forest. So, ta-ta for now.